some of your closest friends, right? You have to pay very close attention to the people that you let around, your closest friends. Now, you're always gonna be able to grab something from them that's either negative or positive that can help your life be better. You know what I'm saying? Don't just, oh, don't just let um, something happen and you just look over it. Pay attention, read it, and capitalize off of the positivity or the negativity. Whether they are good friend, bad friend, learn something from each person, each individual that you come in contact with. Always learn something. Your life doesn't just pop up and be how you think it's gonna be. You have to plan it, manifest, like you gotta pray, you gotta manifest it and you got to really work towards how you want your life to be otherwise it's not you're just not going to wake up and have this great life you, like it don't work life don't work like that you're not going to just be living happily ever after and you know what i'm saying or not, anything like that you basically have to force your life to be how it's going to be so anything is possible for anybody you know what i mean and like i say if y'all stop putting all y'all attention into the wrong things maybe you will be rich because the same amount of time you put in that game or that girl or whatever you think about that's more than investments and money that's why like once you get strict about yourself and about your life and about your goals things will change you feel me a lot of things that change around you so once you get things straight you, you already know how it go like it just basically just being you know, very strict on yourself, basically being humble. Some people get a lot of money and get real cocky, you know what I mean? And basically the cockiness runs a lot of things away because they get so cocky. And then you ain't, you know it's a lot of people that been rich before and then fell broke. And you gotta understand why did they get rich and fall broke is because some of the times the cockiness, you know what I mean? Sometimes you gotta humble yourself, be strict on yourself, and just really focus, focus on your plans. And you know, know what you're doing. Excuses are goal killers. Excuses are like ways to hold you back versus like me, sometimes you do have to listen. You know what I'm saying? Like you don't have to take credit or you don't have to take in what everybody tell you, but sometimes it's just good to listen and just think about things that people are telling you basically like with the excuses or whatever a lot of people um they just make a lot of excuses for no reason they always they hurrying up they down in they self like like me you ask me a question or you tell me to do something or we talking about goals and stuff i'm not always just negative towards my own self oh well um i can't do this the way that this is supposed to be done like this because it is well this 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 and this this because it is this because of that instead of just doing what they're supposed to be doing they just make a million a million a million excuses and that's what's really holding them back